So you want to download some shaders. You want to have a shadow, you want the water to have reflections, and you want the ground to be shaded. And maybe you want glowing ores and galaxies in your sky. Well, you've come to the right place. This is like a one minute tutorial, so in one minute you'll have shaders installed on your PC. Also, please do subscribe. I'm not doing this for free, so thank you. The first step to installing shaders is to make sure that you're running Minecraft on Optifine. If you don't have Optifine installed, then go watch the video. The little link to it will be in the top right corner of the screen right now. That is my tutorial on how to download Optifine. Once you have Optifine installed, for me, I'm going to be showing you how to download the complementary shaders. There is also a link in the description if you don't want to follow these steps. Step one, open a fresh Google tab. Go to the top and search complementary shaders. The first one here is from curseforge.com. I recommend not downloading shaders from anywhere else but curseforge because other places are sketchy and I would not go to those sites. Only use curseforge because it's the only one that you should trust. Now the first one you're going to see is complementary shaders on https colon backslash backslash www.curseforge.com complementary shaders. Click on that. You'll be presented with a page like this. Forget everything else on this page. Don't even click that download button. Go up here and hit the files button. You'll be presented with a page like this. There'll be a long list of different versions listed right here in this column underneath game version. Find the version of Minecraft you want your shaders to run on. I will be doing 1.16.5. I'd recommend the newest version available, but 1.17 for some reason is fairly new and doesn't run shaders very well. So I recommend 1.16.5. That's my recommendation. You don't have to listen to it. Hit the little download button next to the version you want. You'll be presented with a page like this. Don't click on any anything just wait for the countdown to disappear and then once it's done counting it'll appear right down here in the bottom left corner of your screen step two is to open your file explorer go up to the top and select view make sure hidden items is checked this allows you to see things you previously could not once you have that checked go over to the side and find this pc open the drop down menu and find downloads select downloads and you will see all of your recently downloaded files find the folder or zip folder that you just downloaded for the shaders, left click and then right click to bring up the drop down menu, select copy. Step three is to go back to Minecraft, press escape to bring up the pause menu, go to options, video settings, then select shaders. If you've never downloaded shaders before, this area will be empty. Go down to the bottom, select shaders folder. Once you click on that, your file explorer will open and it'll bring you straight to a folder named shader packs. Inside that shader packs folder that it has brought you to, right click and select paste. Paste that folder that you just copied slash downloaded into the shader packs folder. Once you've done that, you can hit the X and close the file explorer and you will see that your shader will appear in this menu right here. Once your shader has appeared, all you have to do is click on it like so. Once you've clicked on it, it might take a minute to load. As you can see, it's loading. And once it's done loading, go down to the bottom and hit done, done and done and back to game. And you'll find yourself in Minecraft with shaders downloaded. I also will be making other content that's for entertainment and not just tutorials. So please do subscribe and also have a good rest of your day.